Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello, great to have you with us. Welcome to the distinctive Al Bike Stadium with its tent light structure. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Qatar, and they take on Senegal. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And here's the Qatar starting 11. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But somebody has to step in to join those two midfield players. It could be one of the fullbacks or it could be one of the centre-halves. So keep an eye out for that. And a look at the starting lineup for Senegal. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Sheku Kouyate starts alongside Idrissa Gay in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And the contest begins. Dia. Ismail Assar. Here's Diallo. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. He read the situation defensively and did his job. to attack from the wide areas it's still there for him oh it strikes the bar Idrissa Gay Diasa Idrissa Gay moving the ball effectively And he takes on the shot, and a goal! An early boost for them, the first goal of the game, they're off and running. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly, and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1-0. Number eight, Chico Koyate. Ali. Hatem. Intercepting it intelligently. Ali. Make some progress with the ball at his feet. Showing a lot of guile there. 
just cutting off the supply well not giving the opposition a look in that strong play Afif on attacking possibilities Akram Afif a glorious chance and not cleared away properly and in at the second time of asking just what was required well as you can see the first save is a good one but they can't react quickly enough to the second ball the keeper's a bit unlucky really Underway following the equaliser. Kuyase. Well, can they open up the defence here? Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? They need to get bodies back. Hatem, Karim Budia. Oh, a vital interception. Karim Budia. Hassan Al Haidos. Well, nicely cut out. Ismail Assar. Sar. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Defenders need to cover. This is looking threatening. Could be threatening. What a vital intervention. <laughs> and played short. Applying vigorous pressure. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Can they forge ahead? He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Idrissa Gay. Dia. Karim Budia. Al Haidos. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Fode Palo Touré. Moving it forward. Oh, a fantastic save. And now we find out it was offside anyway. the electronic board showing one additional minute Kuyate the first half here comes to an end well such is the lot of an attacking player some days it works for you on other days 
Not at all, Stuart. Yeah, their passing hasn't been great, but he just hasn't done enough to receive the ball in dangerous areas. He needs to be doing more in and around that penalty box. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Will it happen for them? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Kuyasek. Return to Saar. Kuyate. Now Gay. In position. Can they cover up? Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Taken short. Piano and a good looking ball. A oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. Going short. And with that, the attack fizzles out. An example of how to press. Almoez Ali. Miguel. Chance to do damage. Well, the supporters think it's on. Superb block. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. Back underway, intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Now well, we're into the final half hour. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Oh, he's left his marker for dead. And will it be the leveller? Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Mendy. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Saar. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Kuyase. Saar. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. Hatem. Just 20 minutes remaining now.
Akram Afif. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Chance to finish! Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Ismail Assar. Kuyase now. Well, the attack looks promising. Boule Dia. Assar. Kuyate. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? Well, shielding the ball admirably. And possession given away. A thief. Well, they couldn't keep it. Dia. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Idris Gay skipping away Saar excellent defending Al Haidos Boule Dia that's useful play. Must take the lead here. And still a chance. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Al Haidos. Ali. So two minutes to be added on at the end. And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. Really bright looking attack. So, oh, he's through here. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that will be the winner. Amazing scenes here. Well, as you can see, the defending is all over the place. That's far too easy for the attackers. The goalkeeper's got absolutely no chance there. And it is a tale of misery for them. Not the result they were hoping for. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances. Could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stuart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, I thought he had a good all-round performance today. Only emphasised by the late winner. An extremely important moment, and boy, did he deliver.